Hello, I'm at uh, Hartside in the Juviates today, near Lit Up Spout, and today I'm headed up Shill Moor, which is the hill over there with the snow on it. And then if I've got time, I'll do the hill behind it as well. But uh, I have to get back for my daughter, so I'm not sure I'll have time to do that as well. But then it's not a bad day. So it was going to be blue skies, but still quite a bit of cloud in the Cheviots. But it, uh, the forecast was better for the Cheviots than what it was for the Pennines, so I've come to the Cheviots. Uh, it's a little bit windy, so I'm not sure if you're going to hear us throughout the entire thing, but we'll see how it goes. That there is Dunmore Hill. That's the one which I do with my daughter. And then hedge ups behind there. And by the looks of it, that there is Shill Moor, the one I showed you before. Uh, looks as though it could be Cushet Low, maybe. And then if I've got time, there's Lint Lance on the other side, which I'll try and do if I've got time. It's very windy, so I'm not sure you're going to hear me. I've got my back to the wind at the moment, but... There's the moor hill over there, which I do with my daughter. Hedge up's over there with the snow on it. I had planned to follow this road and then go up this spur to the top of Shill Moor. But I've had a change of heart. I didn't fancy walking on the tarmac. I'm going to follow a track that comes along here and then I'm going to go up over the top to this way instead. And then I'll check the time, and then if I've got the time, I'll, uh, I'll have to head to Lintlands. If not, I'll, uh, I'll come back. I'll come back along the road to save some time. But uh, this is uh, one of the Jewies in Northumberland. This one and Lintlands is another Jewy as well. So. As you, you know, those who have been watching my channel will know that I've been uh, taking off the Jews in Northumberland recently. So, there was a break in the weather, so I thought I'll go for it. I've just stopped for a bit of a uh, bite of eat. Uh, I just had my lunch. It's very windy on the top of here, so I'm busy sheltering uh, on the slopes of Scott Hill before doing Shilmore Summit. But uh, I don't think I'm going to get a chance to do the Lintland, so I was just checking the map before and it looks a little bit further than I thought, so I might have to do that another time. But uh, last night I found out that Wilco had passed away. Now I never got to meet Wilco, but we used to correspond quite a bit because he was interested in history and walks and I do a lot of history and walks as well. And uh, he was very interested in a walk that I was planning on doing later on in the year. And I was kind of hoping that I would have got the chance to have met Wilco and done the walk together with him. Um, unfortunately I haven't finished doing all the research connected with the walk. So I'll get on with doing that, and when I do the walk, I'll do it in memory of Wilco. But uh, he's uh, sorely missed. Uh, I really enjoyed these videos. He was a very knowledgeable man, and knew quite a lot about the Netherlands and a lot about history. So rest in peace, Wilco. You'll be sorely missed on the hills. the camera will appreciate it but here you can really appreciate the size of Dunmore Hill where I took my daughter it's a mighty hill
Show me where everybody. One of the Jewies of Northumberland. It's extremely windy. <laughs> I was going to do Lit Lands. Lit Lands is over there. Behind Bloody Bush Edge. But it looks like it's a bit too far. The ground's a bit too rough to get there in time. I don't have time to do it today. So I'll do that one another time. What I'll do is I'll enjoy the summit for a bit and then I'll head back down. Cush it low, bush no. Dumbo hill, head jump hill, achieve it. Some crows trapped in the grouse pen. Half a deer has bait. <sighs> there ain't going nowhere. I came off the hill the wrong way. I don't know the trespass for someone's garden. I put my route down below, but uh, don't follow it. <laughs> so, it seemed a shame not to fit it in a spout because they're now so close to it. Let it spout, everybody. Thank you for joining me on this walk. This is where I leave you. Don't forget to comment below, like, subscribe, and uh, I'll see you on the next one.